Howdy, peeps. This is Marvy Pan. Welcome back. I've had another week's break from playing this just because of schedules. However, we are back in, and I recall that we need to uh, restore power to Solomon's Habitation Tower Transit, as is on the screen right there. So at the end of the last episode, we got rid of the security guard with use of the alien. Uh, but yeah. I'm pretty much low on... I'm out of flamethrower fuel. <laughs> Not low, just completely out of it. So let's just have a walk around this area, see if we can find anything of use. Oh, the alien is above us in the vent. I say the alien. One of many. <laughs> we just need to navigate around. Got pipe bomb in my hand, ready to go, just in case. Oh, there doesn't really seem to be anywhere. Yes, please. That could come in handy. Okay, all right, that's good. Let's just creep around the other steps. Oh, uh, we might need to go through those uh, transit barriers. Uh. Yep. Where is the vent? I can't see it. Oh, hi. Iron torch, don't say that I've got to use that, it's going to make loads of noise. Fuck. <laughs> now, oh, I was about to say, do I use a noise maker? I can't! Shit. <sighs> Fuck it. Yes! Terminal. I can't see shit. Hold on. Shut the door. Okay, it's shut. Fantastic. Any goodies? Yep. Lovely, 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 lovely. Ooh, no, don't use that. Sebasto Link! Hey, buddy. It's been a while. <laughs> Error. Okay. Uh, code for repair job. Hey, Myers. My shift's over and I'm clocking off. If you turn up to the... We repair the system in the next three hours. I won't be here, so the code you need is 1851. Tomorrow together, number four. Oh no 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 wait 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 wait. Uh, our synthetic future. With the guidance of key seekers and executive talent, Sylvester Pollard has become an outpost of progress. A trade hub, a vibrant community, and a beating heart of the Seeks and Synthetic Solution. Sevastopol is the primary off-planet site for development, sales, and maintenance of Seeks and Androids. From Sevastopol's unique position in the cosmos, we can ship our range of working Joes wherever they're needed in colonial space within months, not years. Above and beyond our reliable and cost-efficient Synthetics is Sevastopol's governing AI, Siegson's award-winning Apollo system. Through the hard work of our scientists and Siegson's bold investments, the station is now a showcase for the economical and self-governing artificial human op operations. Even now, our sales executives are overseeing the population of Apollo mainframes across colonial space. Just as we assured you throughout this journey, we made it to tomorrow, and we did it together. Audio. You guys took too long down there. I had to power down this facility and 
take the last transit. We can't afford to keep the sanctuary wide open. All it'll take is one creature to get in, and all the supplies and weapons we've taken will come to jack shit. Me and mine are gonna sit this out till the rescue comes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but when you started chasing after a ship that'll never come, you broke with the plan. Sinclair out. Okay, so remember the code, 
Okay, so we've restored the power. Now we just need to go out and call the transit, get on it without the alien. Without the alien noticing. Uh oh, it's coming, it's coming. Shit a brick. Kind of vents. Yes. Hey. Hey, what the fuck? Oh, okay, I need to go in that little office. Stop making noise with the fucking doors. Shit. Ah! Okay, let's get in here, let's get in here. I might feel a little bit more safe. And please let there be some flame for our fuel. Face hugger, hopefully without dis distracting the alien. Go on, go in the vents. Fuck! There we go. Motherfucker. This bit. Although it's just a case of going in that room and hit a switch or it's fucking hard. You're in a small space. <sighs> With the alien. And just the slightest distraction, you you and because I've got fuck all flame for our fuel left. <sighs> Let's try again. Not see me. I think I just got a get out of jail free card there. Going to vents, fuck. Second time lucky. Nope. Oh, fuck! You bastard. I need flames. Shit. Okay, it's in the vents. Now's my chance. Let me please, please get this face hugger without distracting it. Please! Stay in the vents. Stay in the vents.
It's at the door. It's at the door. Fuck off. Whatever I need to do in this room, I need to do it and save it. Man alive, do I need to save it? It's right outside. Shit! Going to fence. Okay, so now I need to take the transit, but I need to wait for the alien to go in the vents to go and call the transit, and then... Shit. Slow progress on this episode, but vital progress, and it's tough. It's, this section is really... I don't know how other people have struggled, but because I've got fuck all flamethrower fuel. I'm a bit bollocksed. Okay, let's go and call the transit. Hope we get lucky. I think when we do call the transit, we're gonna duck in this room here. I think that's a good tactic. We've got a door in front of us, we've got barrels, and we're right near the transit. Hopefully we can hit the tram and turn up as well. And I've got a little bit of flame for our fuel, hopefully enough to get us in there. I distract it with a smoke bomb. Okay, transit's turned up. So is the alien. Shit! Oh. Oh! Man alive, that section was really tough. It took a lot longer than what I hoped it would, but fuck, we got through it. What's next on the agenda then, huh?
Sevastopol a while ago. I know you're concerned, but it's ancient history. It's just some stuff I need to know. A routine company transmission packet sent from the edge of Thetis before a ship started its trip home. Nothing that's gonna break anything. So what? Pre hypersleep health checks have been performed on the entire crew, including the systems from the engineer staff. The ship's cat. Everyone regular, present, and correct. I sat out in the report I've just logged with Mother. I have a little more work to do setting up my equipment and initializing systems, but otherwise, we're ready to go. Was that Samuels? Is there anything here? Any systems that I can access? No. Okay, okay, alright. <laughs> Now's our fucking chance. Do we go? Oh. What a knobhead. Oh. Find an alternate route to the space flight terminal. Reverse. Oh, hey, fucking hell. Station. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. <laughs> Someone having a drink in here? <laughs> huh. Yeah. So it's just a, a temporary hiding spot, yeah? So on edge, fucking hell. What? So 
some of that. Okay, so we know the alien comes in that room. What have I got? No flame for a fuel. Fuck! Shotgun, pipe bomb. There is flame for a fuel. Somebody say that without fucking it up. Jesus. Flame for a fuel. Just inside this room. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. We know the alien's about to pop up. attention to me. Go for the fucking smoke bomb. Go on. Go. Go home. Fucking hell, how many times am I going to fail? The last few episodes, Jesus. Oh, uh, what? Don't need to read all this. Last stand. Mendon Mendonka? What the fuck? How do you pronounce that? We rounded up everyone we could find, camped out in the rec room. The security system we discussed is rigged up, but you won't be able to get in the old way. We caught a stranger sneaking in. After a couple of hours, he confessed who let him in. Um, we threw them both out. We've got only limited space and supplies here. We've got to control who gets in. If they want in, they've got to bring something to the table. What you need is in the usual place. I don't want to stay here, but you'll know what I mean. I've changed the code to 1984. Use what you find there, of course. We'll need to make sure that you've got supplies. Uh, you promised us, but we're checking. We'll check you upon entrance. I'm sure you've got what we need. After all, I vouched for you. Don't make me regret it, Jake. 1984. Shut out. Is anyone there? It's Denver. I'm back with the supplies, but I'm locked out. Nobody's answering. What's happened? Was there an attack? It's getting worse out here. You have to let me back inside now. My wife is in there. She'll tell you who I am. I have the supplies. Someone answer me. 1984. After evacuation, do not re-enter the station until advised to do so by the orbital emergency convener. So, where, how the fuck do I get in? Oh, it's powered, it's powered. Uh, okay. A little puzzle there to solve. We've got it covered. Hopefully the alien doesn't uh, cause us any grief. Keycard? somewhere even. It's on the body. It's got to be. Fuck. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. <gasps> no! Give me some goodies. Come on. Did you see me? What are you hissing at? It's alright, I've got fuel. i got fuel!
How the fuck? Ah, oh, shit. That's gonna make noise. Fuck, I need a save station. I need a save. At least I got a bit more fuel. Just a little bit to keep me going. Everything looks pretty fucked right now. Can't hear the alien. Uh. I can hear a safe station. <gasps> okay, fuck it. We're saving it. Man alive. Slow progress, important progress. Oh, God, fucking hell. It's all just getting that little bit too tense now. But, oh man. What we're going to do is end this episode here. It's quite enough for one day. Thank you for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah, I sense we're coming to the end. Hopefully, we've got a few more episodes in it. And, yeah, I'll see you next time. So, until then, ciao for now.